I'm wearing all of the flowers today. So at the moment bad stuff is going on and we need to talk about it. I cannot bring anything new to the table but what would have already been said. It is terrible that a guy had to lose his life and that a family had to lose their father. And it is terrible that it had to be filmed to make it matter because black lives do matter. I'm one of the lucky ones being a white woman in a white country. I don't experience racism on a day-to-day -day basis and I have since I was a little kid known that skin color is only that, skin deep. And that's my philosophy and has been it all my life. And it's not going to change. That's what I'm teaching my kids and hopefully that's what they'll teach their kids. Although I haven't seen the video of George Floyd's death, I do applaud the girl Daniela Frazier who was brave enough to take the video of this gruesome murder by a policeman. She's a hero, not only to the black community, but to everybody in the entire world for bringing this to our attention. Thank you, Donella. Now back to the regularly scheduled light and fluffy stuff that I usually make for you guys. Thank you for listening. So this is how far I've come with this project. I do need to take it in just a little bit down here. and at the side seams and of course I have a little bit of room out, he out here that I can take in and then the center back this is going to be beautiful this is the second twirl and I took off all of the seam allowance that I had put down here before because just to see how it fits me truly and I think this one is ready to do a bit of boning So this one does have a little bit of a sucky any stomach thingy and I'm making these eyelets with thread as that is going to be much more nice to have against my skin than metal eyelets. I'm just burying the nut in here between the layers and I do have four threads in my needle and then I just go around and around usually about twice I'm done. And when filming them like this, they seem pretty big, but 
they're not actually too big. They're just a stomach pulling device. <laughs> sewing in this project done that and it's a more than full circle skirt as it is three half circle skirts for me and then here in the back I pleated it so that it would be right for me the right size for me and it is so swooshy it's about knee length But it's, it's fun to wear and I'm going to enjoy it when it gets a little warmer again. But I like it. And it's the first time that I've used piping in this way, or in any way actually. But I have piping all around the bodice and in the sleeves. And I love it. Swoosh! I just want to Turn and turn and turn again. So it now just needs to hang for the hem to drop so that I can finish this and find some place to wear it. Hopefully it'll be summer, more summer than it is right now, soon, so that I can wear this beautiful creation of mine. Okay, so that was some video. I hope you liked it. Please like the video and subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so you'll get notified each time I upload a new video. Thanks for watching. Bye!